please subscribe and you can download this code from description below. Title, Python script, calling process. Start, accessing 64 bit process modules from a 32 bit process. Introduction When working with Python scripts, you may need to interact with external processes and access their modules. However, there are some limitations when it comes to 32-bit processes accessing modules of 64-bit processes and vice versa. In this tutorial, we will explore how to use Python sub-process module to call an external process, process.start, and understand the challenges and solutions when a 32-bit process needs to access modules of a 64-bit process. Prerequisites Note, the code examples provided here assume you are using a Windows system, as Windows has stricter limitations when it comes to inter-process communication between 32-bit and 64-bit applications. Windows operating system enforces a separation between 32-bit and 64-bit processes due to compatibility and security reasons. This separation affects how processes can interact with each other. If you try to access modules or resources from an external 64-bit process using a 32-bit Python script, you may encounter errors or limitations. Python sub-process module allows you to start and communicate with external processes from your Python script. To handle the 32-bit versus 64-bit process interaction challenge, you have a few options. 32-bit Python to 32-bit external process, if your Python interpreter is 32-bit, it can easily interact with 32-bit external processes. This includes calling the process and accessing its modules without any issues. 64-bit Python to 64-bit external process, similarly, a 64-bit Python interpreter can interact with 64-bit external processes without any problem. Accessing 64-bit process modules from a 32-bit Python script. Let's create a Python script that demonstrates how to call a 64-bit external process and access its modules from a 32-bit Python script using a 64-bit intermediary script. We'll use the sub-process module for this. Step 1, create a 64-bit Python script, bridge underscore script dot py. Step 2, create a 32-bit Python script, main underscore script dot py. In this example, main underscore script dot py is a 32-bit Python script that calls the bridge underscore script dot py, which is a 64-bit Python script. The bridge underscore script dot py can then interact with the 64-bit external process without any issues. When dealing with the challenge of accessing modules of a 64-bit process from a 32-bit Python script, using an intermediary script or process is a practical solution. By creating a bridge script that matches the bitness of the target process, you can achieve the desired inter-process communication while complying with the operating system's restrictions. Chat GPT Title, Python script, calling process.start, limitations of 32-bit processes accessing modules of 64-bit processes. Introduction In this tutorial, we will explore the topic of launching external processes from a Python script using the sub-process module, and specifically, we'll address a limitation where 32-bit processes may not access modules of 64-bit processes. We will explain why this limitation exists and provide a code example to demonstrate the issue and potential workarounds. To follow this tutorial, you should have a basic understanding of Python and how to use the sub-process module. In Windows operating systems, processes can run in either 32-bit or 64-bit modes, and there are certain restrictions when a 32-bit process tries to access a 64-bit process or its modules due to the differences in memory architecture. This limitation primarily arises from the separation of the Windows system on Windows on Windows, WoW 64, subsystem. 
when you launch an external 64-bit process from a 32-bit Python script, the launched process is also 64-bit. This means that the memory spaces for the parent, 32-bit, and child, 64-bit, processes are separate, and you may encounter problems when attempting to interact with or access the modules of the child process. Let's illustrate this limitation with a code example using Python subprocess module. In this example, we are trying to open the Notepad application, which is a 64-bit process, from a 32-bit Python script. You might encounter an error like this. To overcome this limitation, you can use one of the following workarounds. Use a 32-bit version of the external application, if possible, use a 32-bit version of the external application if it's available. This ensures that both the parent and child processes have the same architecture. Use a 64-bit Python interpreter, if your Python script is not tied to a specific 32-bit interpreter, consider using a 64-bit Python interpreter. This will allow you to launch 64-bit processes without the compatibility issue. Interact through inter-process communication, IPC you can establish communication between the 32-bit and 64-bit processes using mechanisms like pipes, sockets, or other IPC methods, allowing data exchange between the two processes. Use a third-party solution, some third-party libraries or tools may help bridge the gap between 32-bit and 64-bit processes. For example, PyWin32 can be used to create an out-of-process COM server to access 64-bit components. Conclusion In this tutorial, we discussed the limitation of 32-bit processes trying to access modules of 64-bit processes when launching them from a Python script. We provided a code example to demonstrate the issue and offered potential workarounds to address this limitation. It's important to choose the workaround that best fits your specific use case and requirements. ChatGPT